And here we are on the ice side. Well, we were on the ice side already. But now we're on the icy, icy side, I guess. I'll just head up this way past the Bigfoot. And, uh... Across over there are some split pads right here, and over this way is a warp. Yeah! There's another warp that's not too far from here. And as soon as I get those notes, I'm gonna head over and get that one. Ooh. Fire for the win! So... Excuse me. Jeez, I gotta quit doing that. So, backflip and glide here. We'll head past the little igloo over there on the right. Oh no, what's this guy's doing? What's this guy's doing? Alright, without your permission. Whatever. So there's the other warp point. Now let's get back to Banjo. And we can bring Banjo there. Now that we've activated it. It's a nice little trick you can use when splitting up like that to kind of get one to the other, if you know what I mean. Shoot, I saw that note back there. I'm gonna have to get that a little later. Anyway, whatever. So, the two are reunited once again, at long last. So, there's Wumba's Wigwam, as you can see back there. I want to go ahead and get this Globo back here, though. So, you can grip grab this if you want. I don't really care to, because that stupid monster comes down anyway. Gets me half the time. Might as well just go through the water. So, here's the Globo, and there's some ice here. Oh, shoot, that's right. You have to wait till the alien's trapped in it, otherwise it doesn't break. I don't know what's up with that. <laughs> I think he's got to keep the challenge. Man, that dragon needs to shut up! Oh, <laughs> see, this is what I'm talking about. This is why I take the water. Oh, thank goodness. I didn't need another hit there. Jeez, that guy is firing shit at me. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, whatever, let's go to Wumba's Wigwam. Okay, now it turns out this is the world where Wumba and Mumbo are actually connected. Physically, it doesn't seem possible, but you just warp in the curtains here, walk into the curtains, and you come out in Mumbo's hut. And this is a practical way to actually get to Mumbo's hut, since if you try to go to it on the fire side, you might go to the wrong Mumbo skull, which will be important later. <laughs> That's uh, rather confusing. So we go through this stupid conversation for the umpteenth time. Or actually, we're still in single digits as far as how many times we've had it. But anyway, yes, I want Momo's help. What do you think? No, I just came to play cards. Mm. No better time to take a drink than when you're having a conversation that you don't want to have. Urgh, let's do it, Mumbo. Let's go bring some aliens back to life. Well, we'll make sure you go back out Wumba's way. Because there really isn't much for Mumbo to do on the fire side, which is weird, since that's where his skull is, but... Um, but whatever. So we'll just take him out this way. So weird to see Mumbo coming out of Wumba's hut, though. So, uh... We got a little narrow passageway here. This is a little tricky, because the ice is slippery, so... We might have a little fail montage going on here. Oh, here we go! Get some more toilet paper! Okay, I'm back. Let's do this again. Oh, look at this. Oh, man! Jeez, I just did that on the second try. I can't believe that shit. Hope this works. Yeah, I hope it works, too. Since it only took us two tries to get up here. Jeez. I'm actually relieved. Hey, guess what, dude? You're not dead. Big drop her lots. Where am I? You're in Tahiti. Didn't need puny earthling magic. Could have used special powers instead. Well, screw you. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, really? Oh, okay, now we can break the ice because it's going to show you where the three kids are now that you brought him back to life, so it'll go and put them where they are. But you'll actually have to do a number of different things to help them. Like, there's two of them trapped in the ice that you'll have to build drill. The other one, you'll have to hatch to warm them up. Like, you have to use the hatch move. And I guess, I don't know, it's gross, whatever it is. There's the other one there. Mm -hmm. By the way, I didn't mention it, but this place has got really epic music. There's the one that needs the hatching. And we'll be doing that for quite a while. Ow! So, mm, can't do much to help you there. Can't build drill with the feathers on my head. 
We're gonna head behind the alien over here. Oh no. Not that guy again. We'll just bring Mumbo across here, try to get him to the other. Um, shoot. No, this is not where I want to go. We need to get him over to Saber Man and bring him back to life too, because he needs some reviving. Apparently everybody's dead around here, so we just have to do it to it. That jiggy inside the wall there, that's the one in the ice train station. So we won't be getting that till a little later. There's notes here. Ugh, stay away from that. <laughs> we'll do this all later. Because, uh, we'll need to... Oh, crap! Oh. Okay, here we go again. Maybe we can get this one on the second try, too. Ooh. Oh! Nice. Hope this works. You know it's gonna work, Mumbo. You just gotta have faith in yourself. You know how it is. Ah, uh, and that wall behind Saberman? That was the Hellfire Peaks Jiggy we picked up from uh, the secret passage in Glitter Gulch Mine. So, we've definitely been doing some work here. Many thanks, young sir. I've been frozen in there since 1984, what? Dude, that's 25 years ago, man. I mean, that was only 15 years ago when the game came out, but wow. <laughs> Cable Man, that's hilarious. Oh, yeah, that stupid ice dragon. So he's been up there doing this for 25 years, too? Damn. Okay, so let's get Momo back to his hut. Quickest way to do that is to die. As I said before, you got unlimited lives in this game, so you might as well take advantage of it. So this will take Mumbo back to his skull on the fire side, actually, but we don't need to go out there. So we'll just go inside and relinquish control and get back to Banjo-Kazooie here. Back on your throne, Mumbo. We're done with you for now, anyway. We'll have to use him again later, but we can't until we set the... It's designed so that you can't do it. You have to use him twice. Because when you use him to revive the the father alien, only then do the kid aliens become freeable. And then after you free them, you'll have to revive one of them, so... Yep, so you can't very well do them at the same time, but, you know... Now we get the Hailfire Peaks transformation. Ooh. I'm call this Snowball. Really? Snowball? Oh, that's so original. That's like what somebody would name their cat if it was white. But whatever. So this is the Snowball form. Notice you start with one life. That's kind of the gimmick of it. But as you roll around in the snow, you gain life and you also become bigger. So I don't know how the shorts thing works with that shoot. I'm not gonna be able to get through this door. You need to be like really small to get through it, and I just got big. That's not gonna work. Maybe I can go around this way. Yep. Oh, uh, maybe not. Let's just do this. See, when you get hurt, you get smaller again, as you can see. So well, I probably could have made that, but uh, let's get down to one, because I'll I'll go from two to three as I'm rolling to the door. So see. So, you need to be like one or two to get through. You might be able to get through it as three, I'm not sure. So, we need to get up to five. Ow. Stop it, stupid. We need to get Snowball up this narrow path right here. And if you hold Y, it does the little starry attack. That's why I got that trail coming out behind me. As I'm doing the attack, it helps you to move faster. Dang it! Oh, this is gonna be one pain in the ass. Gotta be able to get this eventually. Jeez. Oh, yes! We did it! Nice. I'm gonna have to cut some of that out. That took me a while to get up there. <laughs> Probably like a minute and a half or something. Over here is the train switch for the ice train station. So now we can take the train to the ice side and get the jiggy that's there. But as you might recall, I parked the train on the fire side and it's too hot over there for the train to function. It's overheating. So we have to still take care of that which might be a while before we get around to that. So, just move on to the pad. Yeah, that's what I did. That's what I thought I was gonna do. <laughs> the snowball is hilarious. So you're gonna warp to the fire side. You wanna be fast here because you're gonna melt as a snowball. If you can get over and retain your life, you'd be good. Ha! Take that, hands. 
Now we finally got those notes that we were looking at. Let's go out the door here. And take this over here. You can get to the top of the oil building. Let's see if there's anything worth digging up down there. Oh my. Well, looks like we're running oil rigs now here on Banjo Tui. Who would have thought we'd be doing this? Something did turn up. I heard it. Just caught a glimpse of it. Hmm. It's a jiggy. Oh, what did you think it was going to be? That's a nice little view at it from, uh, from Grunty Industries there. 